is everyone staring at that monkey's ass? Probably his cowlick. Ow! I wasn't talking about you. I meant that. Oh. Well then, this is for making me misunderstand. I got the idea for this escape plan when Lippy and I were out for a walk and he started climbing these vines. So really it was the monkey's idea. Oh, and I suppose Lippy wrote a note saying SOS with directions to the canyon and taped it to his collar too. That note? Oh, by the rings of Saturn. Uh, uh, don't worry, civilians. I trained that dirty ape myself. He'll know how to send help. He stopped climbing! What's he doing? I say kill him with rocks! You know, one talk with Frida, and you're on the specials board. Hello, can you go? Well, now you know. The family drives a canoe and was down the next stop straight drop little town. That's a whole lot of There's no escape, lads. Bad luck, so settle in. Yes, Dad. In Crash Canyon. Magic. Norm, people can hear us. No, we can't. Just keep going. Oh, my God. Relax. I'm sure it's only Vernon. I can assure you it's not just Vernon. I heard it, too. You reminded me I have no one. Sorry about last night. You know, the event with the physical stuff. It's this annoying canyon. There's absolutely no privacy. I know. Even in the shower, I feel like I'm starring in a European soap opera. They show everything, you know. Well, we have to figure something out. Because that part of a relationship is very important to a healthy, functioning marriage. Without it, I can get a little stressed. Don't worry, I'll find us somewhere quiet where we can, um, you know, get our freak on. I can hear you two, and it's disgusting. It's worse than that pickle and donut cartoon they made us watch in health class. Okay, let's just forget about it and go get our fruit. <laughs> we can pretend we're farmers. Celibate farmers? No, fruit farmers. Come on, gang, where's that old Wendell spirit? My spirit died the minute we fell into this canyon. It choked to death on unfairness and stupid. What in the name of Newton's abacus? <laughs> Almost all the fruit was gone. Someone or something. Ate most of it before we got there. Well, we know it couldn't have been you two. You are busy with your noises. Don't be embarrassed. I had a boyfriend like that once. He was almost as bad as his father. Anyway, I think it is the work of a big, disgusting animal. Hey, it wasn't me. I was there early and all the trees was bare as... him. Because he's a bear. Ha! Your metaphor makes me feel like I'm watching a child with no arms getting picked last for volleyball. Oh, the child will cry, but the tears will bring no arms. I suppose you could do better. The trees were as empty as a pope's swear jar. Or as empty as a snake's shoe closet. Or as empty as Coma Steve's dance card. Do I need to go on? Screw you. Screw all of you. Oh, come on! Okay, someone can move a chair, you know! Thank you, Norman. Screw all of you! This has been happening for quite a while. As quick as the fruit grows back, it disappears again. The whole thing is muy strange. Very muy. Why doesn't somebody just stake out the orchard and find out what's happening? Oh, we've tried. Something always seems to go wrong. We're late. We would have been here an hour ago if you didn't take so long getting ready. Well, I'm sorry. I'm not like you. I have hair to style. I like to look good. And you call that good? Hanging your head ain't gonna help. Why don't you hang yourself and see what that does? Uh. 
Butch? Yeah? What's an orchard? It's like a curse. No one can catch the culprit, and he remains as invisible as my panty lines. You see? Invisible. Invisible. Are you still looking? Take your time. I can convince you all day. Mark my words, Carl. This is going to be the best picture in Filmywood history. I'm talking award-worthy. And you want to know why? More than anything, critics love arty farty book adaptations, but audiences want action flicks. I'm going to give them both. I just got a training bra and my period. Blossoming womanhood and Japanese lizard monsters. Now that's a four-quadrant picture. That was close. <laughs> well, I guess I can always go back to my old job. Give me your wallet. Easiest money you'll ever make. All you gotta do is tell me which shell the rock is under. What's a shell? Is this one? Did I win? That's a twig. This is a shell. There's the rock. It's easier when you don't cover it with that thing. There's got to be a better way to turn a buck in this hole. It's a film truck. Look at this. Lights, cameras. I can make a movie and charge admission. I'll make a mint. Good idea. Let's burn it. What? No. We'll be rich. There's no other entertainment around here. Butch can put a lot of stones in himself. The trick is not to eat for a few days and don't ignore no holes. You know. Roxy and Jake aren't around. Honey, we could go inside and, you know. <laughs> I know, all right. I just have a problem talking about it thanks to a repressed youth. But what about the sound? I'll only use sign language. If you want, you can pretend I'm that pretty deaf girl from the grocery store. <gasps> Jake, what are you doing here? Just making a movie. Try not to look at the camera. It breaks the illusion of candidness. Perfect! A dining scene! Lots of movies have those. Now, everyone, just go about your business like we're not here. Uh, please pass the salt, dear. Certainly, honey. Would you also like the pepper? I find that when someone wants salt, they also oftentimes want pepper. Guys, people don't talk like that. No one's gonna believe you're this boring. I would. You all are. This place is hell! Conflict. That's great. Now, how about something else interesting? See this? If you lose the toe at work, the government gives you 17 grand per toe. That's why I got no payments on my scooter. I know a guy who actually paralyzed himself at work and made enough for a race car and a Russian bride. Clever quadriplegic bastard. Ma, do I smell like you or daddy? Like a mix. Half me, half daddy, and half both of us. I heard sniffing out here. Oh, now, don't poke out those pits. Pure gold. <sighs> oh, yeah. oh, we're missing all the fun. Too bad. Stay professional. Yeah, Malaysia. A motion picture. You know I have some past experience on camera myself. Freeze! Hands where we can see them! Now! It's a combination of raw talent and racial profiling. I'm what you would call a double threat. If you're looking for Pristine's good side, it's her back as she leaves the room. You can shoot Roy's from anywhere. Mm, that boy doesn't have a bad side. Sheila, stop it. That's vandalism. And I was going to order soup. I'm just stressed, Norm. Intimacy is an important part of marriage. And if I am not happy, a lot more spoons are gonna suffer! Without anything in the orchard, that's the fruit plate. I am ashamed. But I won't lower the price. That would be surrender. And I only surrender to my passions, of which I have many. Thank 
you everyone for coming, and more importantly, for paying the admission price. And now, I present Our Canyon, a Jake Wendell film. Crash Canyon. It's beautiful. It's idyllic. But is it perfect? Sure, it looks nice on the surface. But dig a little deeper and you'll find the truth. This place is hell! Mm, that boy doesn't have a bad side. A place where everyone has a secret and no one is safe. Girl, boy, girl, boy, girl, boy. Humanity's darkest corner, the canyon. A Jake Wendell production. So? What did you think? <gasps> Let's kill him! Uh-oh. Bear lover. Pervert. Hey, lady, you spend six months in space with a monkey and see where you end up. If this is hell, then you, young lady, are the devil. Don't you have a moron to lust after? You know, your husband makes me sick, too. Yeah, go do whatever you were doing in that talking mirror light thing. We don't want to be your friend no more, because you made us look stupid. Really, Sheila? The dump? This is worse than that hotel we went to for our honeymoon. And that was a Radisson. It's perfect. No one's stupid enough to hang around the dump. Hi, Mom and Dad. Ah! What are you doing here? Hiding. How about you guys? We're looking for a place where your father and I can... Get exercise! You can't ever have enough exercise. Stretching, cardio, maybe also some weights. But you also need a healthy diet, carbs, proteins, grains. It's all in the food pyramid. Jake, what were you thinking with that movie? I tried to only show nice stuff, but it was boring. So to make it interesting, I kind of made it look like everybody is a horrible, unlikable freak. Is that so wrong? I don't know how, but you need to make it up to everyone. You can't spend the rest of your time in the canyon being a hated pariah. That's Vernon's thing. Fine. I'll apologize. And give people their money back. Let's not get crazy, Mom. And speaking about getting crazy, I'll leave you and Dad to your sex. What? I go to public school and have internet access. I'm a product of my times. He's gone. Okay, okay, let's get to it. I saw a mattress over there that's only stained on one side. Yeah, I'm not really comfortable here anymore. Can we go somewhere else? Sure. Yeah, no problem. I'm here to apologize about the movie. I don't accept. I'm the laughing stock of the canyon. My new nickname is Boobs Aldrin. How can I be a hero and a laughing stock? The monkey doesn't even respect me. The monkey! Hello? 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 Is anyone, anyone here? here? Is anyone here? <laughs> oh, yeah. Mm. Well. <laughs> Remember in one of your lady magazines again? It's like you're nibbling me in ten different places at once. <laughs> You must have read the same magazine, because I feel it, too. Oh, oh, oh! Ah, 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 get them all! Ah! Thanks to you, Bear thinks I like him. To convince him otherwise, I smacked him so much I got carpal tunnel syndrome and had to outsource the job. Hit him harder! I'm not paying for a tickle fight! It's only weird if you think about it. But I live here, too! Ah, oh. oh, poor fella. Come here, Jake. Oh. <sighs> Two fruit salads. He'll have our pits, rinds, and seeds when we're done. Where have you been? 
green. There is no fruit. The orchard is as barren as my sister. She's tried everything. It's very sad. This is a travesty. Someone other than Reginald and myself needs to do something. I agree. I miss fruit. The lemons were the only thing more sour than dummy. I'm not sour. I'm honest. And honestly, you're a terrible ventriloquist. I'll do it. I'll find out what's been happening to the fruit. And how are you going to do that? With an awesome idea. He said idea, not Ikea. Sly, Butch, it's me, Jake. Oh, hey, a shell! Guys, I figured out how we can redeem ourselves. <gasps> it's all gone. And we missed it because we were sleeping. We were, but the camera wasn't. Come on, let's go check the film. Oh. There it is. Mystery solved. Jake Wendell, you're a genius. Butch is a genius, too. He figured out how to get 42 rocks into his body. Now it's 41. 42 again! Isn't it a beautiful day, Roxy? <sighs> Good morning. These are for you, Shilsy Wilsy, Bilsy Milsy, Filsy Jilsy Bear. Good morning, my Normanimal. Why are you too happy? I don't like it. No reason. <laughs> Can't a wife and her husband just be happy? Oh, my God. I know what you did. And now it's in my head. You should be ashamed of yourselves. Mom, Dad, gather everyone up and bring them to the amphitheater. I have a new film I want to show them. Well, that's going to be a bit of a tough sell after your last one offended everyone. I know. That's why this time it's free. Jake's doing something for free? This must be serious. Why are we here? I could be at home paying a biker to slap a bear. Whatever you're paying Earl, I would have done it for half. That's why you're supposed to get three bids on a project. Traitor! I'll still always hate you. I've forgotten where I live. Listen, listen, everybody. I know you all hate me right now, but I have something to show you that will change your mind. In fact, you may even think I'm a hero. You're no hero. You know how I know you're no hero? Because I'm a hero. That's how I know. Please, please hold your questions and comments till the end of the movie. Then you can decide for yourselves. You see, I've solved the mystery of the disappearing fruit. <gasps> Aretha's own Dorzatum, also known as the Porcupine. That's a porcupine? I thought it was a squirrel getting acupuncture. I just assume since squirrels are into Eastern medicine. Or is that Chinese people? Big deal! So now we know what the problem is, but we still can't fix it. This information is about as useful as tap shoes for Coma Steve. Because he can't walk or move. So obviously, Tap dancing would also be out of the question. Therefore, it would make no sense to buy him tap shoes. Not a good use of money. Bastards! <sighs> oh, Norm! Oh, Norm! Now it's in my eyes and my ears! Turn it off! 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 I didn't know this was here! I didn't watch the film this far! Turn it off! Turn it off! Turn it off! It's exercise. It's just exercise. <laughs> hey, if you want to see a real show, let's look at the constellations, huh? <laughs> Is that or some minor? Oh, oh, Norman. Oh, oh. Wait! Don't turn it off! Look! Oh, Normie, Normie, Normie! The sound of your passion, or what you old married couple call passion, it bothers the animals and they leave. Your lovable coupling, it saved the fruit! Oh, okay. So, so what? You think Norm and I are 
Gonna do that every night? As much as I'd like to, when a man reaches my age, he can't, um, exercise as frequently as his personal trainer may want him to. And you don't need to. I have another idea. Idea, not oh, Norm. Ikea. Oh, Norm! Oh, Norm! Oh, Norm! Normie, Normie, Norm! Oh, Norm! You know, when you think about it, with that tape playing and making so much noise, we could also make noise. And no one would know the difference. Oh, gosh, Norm Wendell, you are a genius. Our grossness is everywhere. My head, in my eyes, in my ears. I can't take it anymore. Well, at least now it's not in her stomach. Didn't we have another bucket? Oh, Norm! Oh, Norm! <laughs> Guy makes love like you. He is the sex what... <laughs> Nudity in him are... 